Welcome to another Buffs preview, everyone. I'm Andy Lindahl along with Mark Johnson, your voice for the Colorado Buffaloes. Mark, tough game for the Buffs last week. They struggled against Kansas. What does this team need to do to right the ship? Well, the first thing, Andy, they've got to start doing is protecting the quarterback. Now, I know this offensive line, they've lost six guys since the start of camp this fall, including a couple of starters in Ryan Miller and Max T.O.T. Mariner. However, that line's not blocking very well, which doesn't give Cody Hawkins a lot of time. I know fans want to blame the quarterback all the time, and Cody hasn't played well, but they've got to start getting some protection up front, start opening some holes for guys like Rodney Stewart and Demetrius just someone to run through. If they can do that, let their uh, offense or their defense rather stay in the sideline because right now they're losing the type of possession battle as well. Now you talked about Cody Hawkins. Obviously there's been a lot of talk whether he should keep his job or not. Are we getting close to a point where Hawk thinks about switching out the QBs? You know, I don't think, th think so at this point in time. And I don't think it's a father-son issue. Dan Hawkins continues to say, if you're going to make that change, you better make it permanent because you're really going to damage the confidence of the guy that you pull out of there. Cody Hawkins right now probably still gives them the best opportunity to win. Matt Bollinger came in last week in that ball game against Kansas, did not throw the ball very well. I don't think he looked very sharp at all. Now, granted, if he was going to be the starter, he gets snaps to the first team all week long, but I don't think that was the issue. I think right now Cody Hawkins needs to stay in there. They've got to get better up front, got to continue to play well defensively. We'll see if they can do it this week against Kansas State. It is a 5 o'clock kickoff at Folsom Field. The Buffaloes hosting the Wildcats will hit the air on 850 KOA at 3 o'clock with Buffalo Stampede. For Andy Lindahl, I'm Mark Johnson. Thanks for joining us here on 850KOA.com.